What's up guys and girls? Welcome back to the channel. Today is again another unboxing, but not a gun. Today I'm going to be unboxing a new thermal rifle scope that I just got. And it's going to be a, a two-in-one. I'm also going to be showing you guys uh, the install on this thermal scope onto my uh, uh, Delton 5.56. All right, so I'm gonna be removing the old scope on this gun right here. Uh, this gun has been sitting in my safe for a very long time, and uh, I think uh, I'm gonna start uh, using it, doing some uh, nighttime hog, feed, hog uh, hunting. So make sure you guys stay tuned, and let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, All right so right here I have is a thermal rifle scope by AGM. This is the Rattler TS25. I've been seeing a lot of good review on this uh, HGM router TS so I just say go ahead and give it a shot uh, go ahead and uh, see what it's all about and put it onto my rifle scope and test it out all right so let's go ahead and do the unboxing all right so right here I got is the again the Rattler TS thermal imaging rifle scope uh, I picked this up on Amazon for about $19.55 um, after taxes and everything it's like $2100 that's the box right here um, here's some specs and stuff um, that's, that's inside here so this this the cool thing about this rifle scope is that it also does uh, recording and picture so it's built in into the rifle scope so there's also uh, two models on this. There's the TS25, which is this one, and the TS35. All right, so mainly most of the features are all the same. Um, I think the the one, the TS35, I think you're able to uh, zoom in farther. Uh, but like I said, they're, they're pretty much similar. Um, and again, you can, you can uh, look at the specs here. And, and see that you know they are identical to each other and can right off the back you open it up there's a soft case in here so take this out put this to the side love this bag all right so here we have a painting cloth and I guess the inspector, I guess the car control, whoever inspected it. I don't know the signature on this, but let's go put that away. So and here is the scope itself. Let's go ahead and set this aside and go through the box first. Then we come back to the scope. There's an all your manual here. Uh, strap, I guess, for the case. And underneath here, you have two batteries. Uh, here's the, like, the rifle scope mount right here put this aside and then also here is the core so I guess if you want to plug up to your uh, laptop computer you guys can so we're just gonna lay it out again here You guys can see owner manuals cleaning cloth and this all the stuff that was in the case so let's go ahead and take a closer look at the rifle scope itself set these guys aside all right so Here's the rifle scope. Put 
pretty nice here. This is where you plug up the uh, core, like a USB-C. Um, you got this here, I guess where you put the battery. There. Flip up. Cap. And these are your, I guess, picture mode, your mode, your menu, zoom, your power, and just basically all there is to it. So again, uh, you guys want to, uh, um, if you guys want to uh, know more about this Rotoscope, there's a bunch of video on YouTube. I'm not going to go into much detail with it, uh, but like I said, uh, I've been seeing a lot of good review on this, so go ahead and went ahead and try it out. Again, this is the AGM Rattler TS25. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this onto my rifle and show you guys uh, the finished product once it's done. All right, so let's go ahead and get to it. All right, so here's my Delton uh, AR15556. Start anything, I guess let's go ahead and check the gun, make sure it's safe. All right, so here it is, you guys can see it's empty. So I'm gonna be adding that thermoscope on this gun here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and remove the old rifle scope and add this one on. So I'll just do a quick time lapse for you guys and then I'll show you guys once it's off. Alright. Now I'm gonna add on this rail mount that came with the thermoscope. So basically you go on here Take out these screws. Let's get some Allen keys a little tight. So let's go ahead and take out this screw with the Allen key. All right, so basically this mount here would just lay onto here. I think it's only one way, so yeah, so you see this right here on this mount, I have this cut right here on this groove, and it, it lay right here with this indention is basically place it there. All right, so now that that's in place, I'm gonna go ahead and add some, a um, little bit of blue Loctite, just so that these screws won't move in the future. Like I said, you don't need a lot. So the cool thing about these, this one here is it got this uh, quick release that came with it and basically you tighten up this screw on this side until it's tight enough to where you like it and then you'll do a final, once you tighten it, once you test fit it, you know, um, do a quarter turn at a time to where it's almost tight and then the final one where you, you lock it down once you lock it down it'll just stay there forever um like i said these mounts are really good i think that it, i'm not gonna have uh, any problem with it moving um once i start shooting the rifle but uh, again like i said this is uh, a new mount that i'm trying out 
I'm gonna go ahead and start uh, test fitting this and to where I like it and test it to where I'm comfortable with the rifle scope. And then I'll get back to you guys uh, once I uh, complete that. All right. I just completed uh, installing this scope here. This thing is uh, adding in the battery right here. Let me just turn this knob here. Open up this door. There's two batteries right there. In there. Like that. Push this back down. Screw this cap back on. Once you got that in, now it should be ready to go. And now the, the next thing would just be uh, siding it in, turn it on, side it in, and then, uh, like I said, just go through the menu option, um, see what you like, and where you like to set it at where you're most comfortable at shooting at uh, again this is all your option right there on the top it's where you're going to be doing most of your uh, settings and stuff um, right here you have the power and then uh, on the top here um, you have your picture yeah i think if you press it one time you'll take a picture and you hold it down it'll start recording video and then to the right here, it's your shutter button. Below is your zoom in and out. So uh, every time you press it, it'll zoom in, I think up to three times, and then it'll zoom uh, back out. Um, so the next one here to the left is the uh, mode button. Basically this switch your palettes from white to black to the rainbow colors. Uh, basically just however you like it and of course the middle is the menu button uh, if you look inside the scope you hold it down the menu will pop on and you kind of just scroll through it set all your setting to where you like it and then dial it in that's how you also uh, sight in your scope again this is the uh, unboxing of the AGM uh, Ragler TS25 thermoscope onto my Delton uh, AR15 5.56 caliber. So, thank you guys for uh, watching. And again, uh, if you guys haven't, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video.